coming up next on the Garden Gate, I'm going to give you some tips on how to get this many finches at your finch feeder. You're watching News Watch, the 5 o'clock show. Hi, I'm Brenda from the Avant Garden Shop, and welcome to another episode of the Garden Gate. Today I'm going to talk to you about attracting specific birds with types of seed and also types of feeders. Because certain birds like certain types of feeders and um, the way they feed from them. So I'm going to start first with cardinals. Cardinals are um, the favorite bird, of course, that everybody loves to get. Their favorite seed is safflower, which is a little white seed that um, they love, but not many other birds love. So it's a nice way to set up a feeding station just for the cardinal. Now cardinals have really short necks, so they can't sit on a regular kind of perch. They need to sit on a um, open feeder, something like this, or a flat feeder, um, tray feeders, that sort of thing, or a perch that they can sit sort of directly in front of their seed without having to twist their neck. Um, they uh, like to feed from the ground. You've probably seen them feeding from the ground. Um, but if you can coax them up to a feeder like this with their favorite seed, then you're good to go. So goldfinches are the next type of bird I want to tell you about. You know they love niger seed, little tiny black seed. It doesn't really sit well in a regular feeder with a big hole, but it goes into a feeder like this one where the hole is really, really tiny. And the goldfinches will come in flocks. So it's really great to have a lot of perches on your bird feeder for goldfinches and other finches. And this one you can see has 20 perches on it, so it's a really great feeder. And what the goldfinch will do is he'll sit on the little perch here and he'll feed from this tiny little hole here. And he'll just sit there all day long and just peck away at it. They'll come and go a little bit. But that's a nice thing because it's basically just for the finches. So you don't end up with blue jays coming to this feeder, for example, because he can't get his beak into this little tiny hole. We have a few different finch feeders. Um, this is one of my favorite. It's from Aspex. And it has a nice feature where the bottom comes off, which makes it really easy to clean. Because there's nothing more difficult than trying to get seed out of the bottom of here, especially the Niger seed, because it's so tiny. And the third bird I want to talk about are woodpeckers, nuthatches, chickadees, and blue jays. They love peanuts. And this time of year during the winter, it's a perfect seed to put out because it gets gives them some extra carbohydrates to keep them warm at night and through the day, obviously, too. The type of feeder that they like to feed from, especially woodpeckers, is something like this where they can grip on the bottom and then they can peck away at the seed. They break up the seed, get a little kernel out, and they'll either eat it right on the feeder or they'll fly away and eat it somewhere else. Woodpeckers and blue jays also love suet. So we have a great suet. There's no filler in it again. It's from that same company, Mill Creek, that makes our bird food. And uh, there's no filler in it at all, so they eat everything. And this feeder here is a great one for the suet. And it has what they call a tail prop on the bottom here. So the woodpecker, again, he'll land on here or he'll use it with his tail to hold on to and then peck away at the suet that's actually in the little cage. Chickadees also love suet. Woodpeckers, blue jays, nuthatches, they all love the peanuts and the suet. And we also have feeders that you can put whole peanuts in. Um, so this is a great feeder for the blue jays, the woodpeckers as well. And it's kind of fun because the woodpecker actually will land on here or the blue jay and he'll either wiggle the seed out through the gaps or he'll peck away at it until the shell comes apart from the kernel inside. Thanks for joining me again on The Garden Gate. See you next time. The Garden Gate is brought to you by the Avant Garden Shop, your destination for gardening accessories and backyard birding supplies.